Yo, 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 what it do, Croc Fam? It's your boy, man, and I'm back with another one. Man, y'all, we is back with that pack that we've been ready to get in. Like, everybody been waiting to see these, man, right here. I've been waiting to see these right here. Like, I'm talking about, man, I was itching to get these. They still haven't really came out yet officially. I think they released in either UK or Japan first. Few of the sites been been dangling with them. Few of them got over to the US. A lot of sizes haven't been available yet because they still haven't been released yet uh, in the US. Man, just to have this pair right now, it's just like another crazy uh, international type pair right now. But man, we've been talking about something like this for a long, long time. If you know, you know, you know what I'm saying? What's in this box right now? We got the good old Croc. Nova Trek joints. And man, we is talking tennis shoe work today. You hear what I'm saying? We is talking tennis shoe work today. Like I say, I'll say this is an unofficial review because these things haven't officially really came out yet. You know what I'm saying? They didn't came out overseas. They still ain't hit, you know what I'm saying, the States yet. Man, we finna dial in on these boys and y'all get to see what's going on with these boys before Crocs get them and everybody else get them, man. Like I say, man, this is beautiful. Dang right. Yeah, you hear? And let's open up this box, man. You see they come through with a nice black box, similar to the lime green Crocs box. Just got the black outer edge. I see a little bit of lime green up on that. Let me pull it back y'all away. See a little bit of lime green up on the left. Designed in Colorado. That's crazy how they was designed in Colorado, but they ain't even in the States yet. That is crazy right there. Like I said, I think UK or um, Japan released these first. Oh, my me. Oh, my Lord. These joints right here. Them boys is fire. First impressions, foam posit, penny hardaway, tight flow, runner vibes, all that into one, man. All that into one. These boys right here is a piece of work, a work of art. You know what I'm saying? Just a work of nature, and we ain't even dialed in yet. See the good old box. Designed in Colorado. We ain't even dialed in yet. Ooh, look at that cushion on the back. No, I'm talking about For the ones that don't know what we got in front of us right now, we got the good old Crocs Nova Trek joints. You know what I'm saying? And you can say... That these is Crocs' first official runners. You know what I'm saying? And these boys right here is super duper dope. God damn. <laughs> Look at that sock knitted on that thing right there. Look at the sock knit on that thing right there. This is crazy. This, man, look, hold on for one second. Hold on one second, man. I got to take the EA Crocs review hat off and put the EA Sports hat on. And EA Sports, that's the that's the day-to-day -day guy right there. You know what I'm saying? The one that everybody know. You know what I'm saying? Personally. Man, put some respect on the fucking name. Like, put some respect on the name Crocs. Like, man, this channel right here, everybody in the Croc fam, we, and you can go back and check, man. We been talking about a pair of runners for the longest. Know what I'm saying? Like I say, like I said once before in one of the videos, the numbers don't tell it all. Know what I'm saying? The numbers do not tell it all. Like people is always watching. We already knew, know what I'm saying? That a few of the croc uh, workers People that's in the corporation, in the building, you know what I'm saying, that's actually working in the house. We already knew some of them was watching, but 
somebody that really got some real say so is watching, watching. Cause man, when I look at these, like they just all the way down to the T on how I explain the runners to be. And I'm talking about, I'm just talking about just normal chatter. You know what I'm saying? Cause somebody said once before, like 15 minutes, uh, bro, for a review. And I told him, I was like, man, I do run my mouth a lot, but y'all can't lie, Croc fam. Like when I run my mouth to y'all and when we doing these reviews, do I not be dropping them gems? Like, I don't know at all, but do I not be, you know what I'm saying, dropping them gems, talking about some real stuff, like just going back in time, just going forward, just giving y'all all the whole rundown instead of just showing y'all the shoot, just giving y'all the full rundown on things. And I remember particularly one time just talking about Crocs needing to come with this runner, you know what I'm saying, with the netted sock type vibe in it, man. And it's just crazy to see that man, the power of the tongue is crazy and somebody actually watching, man. Cause like we said once before as well, like just when I just would throw the normal B2 around, just meaning like version two, the uh, classic Croc sandals, they ended up coming out and uh, on the tag it say B2. It's just crazy, man. Now, I could be wrong, you know what I'm saying? I could be wrong, but like I say, I say put some respect on the name, man, because ain't nobody rocking with us like, Tell me right now, like, who messing with us? Like, me and the Croc heads, like, this this family, man, over the past, when we finna get ready to dive into our third year, this family, man, we have been, you know what I'm saying, the head of what this Croc thing do as far as just breaking down Crocs, knowing what's coming out, knowing what's going on. Like, we been on top of our game. And like I say, I'm not, I don't know it all. I'll tell you quick, I'm I don't I'm not the one that know it all. I don't have the most power of Crocs, but man, the people rock with us the long way. You know what I'm saying? And I know the words being heard through and out. It just crazy. It can't be a coincidence. You know what I'm saying? It cannot be a coincidence. Like I say, Crocs, put some respect on the name. And if you don't, it's still a beautiful thing just to see like the ideas that we thinking and everything that we talk about just coming to fruition. But man, let's get into this review on these good old Nova tracks. And man, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and get right into uh, the close-ups. Know what I'm saying? We'll talk a little chatter about when these came out. I think they came out, um, what was that? I think it was right after my birthday. My birthday was March 4th. I remember being tied up the whole month of March. I think these came out at the end of March. But like I say, they didn't come out, you know what I'm saying, in the USA. They came out in Japan or UK, one or the other. And then one of my sites that I be always, I be telling y'all, man, y'all got to pay attention. I be telling y'all on certain sites. One of them sites that I be on, I think it was Exhibition, ended up dropping these boys. Now, they ended up dropping them, and they only had selected sizes. Granted, they haven't came out in the U.S. yet, so I'm thinking that they just throwing regular sizes or limited sizes out there right there because they they not uh, they didn't get an official rollout uh, as of yet. So they ended up having them. First time around, I missed out because I think they only had, like, smaller sizes, sizes 5 through 9, I believe. And right now... As of right now, say like if they do another rollout before Crocs do a rollout with these sites, because I'm going to keep y'all on game if, if they keep continue to drop. Right now, these are, 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 are in man sizes. You know what I'm saying? They are in man sizes. So say like if, you, if you're a woman, you know what I'm saying? Or if you wear women's sizes, just remember that conversion between the men's and the women's sizes. Because right now on them certain sites, they're going to only do men's sizes. They always have only done... Uh, man sizes they don't do uh conversions even though the shoe can still be converted you know what i'm saying but man let's go ahead and get this close up because these boys right here it's i'm talking about everything everything that you want and more uh in a sneaker these boys are and for me like i say just off of aesthetic looks i was kind of getting like a Penny Hardaway phone posit type vibe just on the looks. No, I don't know if y'all remember them pennies, but I think my uh my brother has some. My oldest brother, he has some white, black, and blue ones. You know what I'm saying? And these kind of remind me of the pennies 
in the back. You know what I'm saying? Now, mind you, this part in the back, let me show you up close. This part in the back right here, this part on the side, right there in the air holes, that's like a knitted sock. You know what I'm saying? Now, let me take this out. Let me take this out. That's like a knitted sock uh, that your foot going in. That right there is like a knitted sock. That's just like sicko mode. Like that is straight sicko mode. And right now they got two colors out of these. I think these are the, uh, is they these, these the elephant uh, ones? Let me double check. Yeah, these the elephant ones. And I think they got like a stucco uh, type color in these. But like I say, man, right now, these boys is so limited. Like, I, I think I did a short. I just did a short. That's how I ended up getting them once I seen. Because they ended up coming out with some more sizes. Now, this site, um, I posted the site. I don't remember right off back. But I posted the site. And this site in particular had more sizes. I think five and seven was might have been sold out. They still haven't came with uh, uh size 12 uh yeah so for all my size 12s out there y'all they still haven't came with a size 12 i ain't gonna lie i had the impulse i was like man they got 11 let me just get the 11 and see what they hit on i just had to i've been desperate to get these now i passed up on the first release that they had on the international site because i had a lot of birthday stuff going on i wasn't really worried about Crocs in the moment, you know what I'm saying? I was having too much birthday fun. So I kind of let them slide, just knowing that another side of mine was going to slide with them. And this time, I was just like, man, I can't let them pass, but they didn't even have 12s on there. You know what I'm saying? I went with the 11. So we'll be doing sizing uh, with these as well. I'll be able to give you a good, a good, good, you know what I'm saying, review on the sizes, because y'all know on most of the things that I get, um, it'd be a size 12. These are size 11, so I mean, I'll be able to give y'all a nice little review once we get to viewing. But man, look at that tongue. Then you got the Crocs on there. And that's like the rubber, rubber type vibe right there, giving that foam vibe from off the clouds. And then them shoe strangers, them shoe strangers is, is, is fucking it up. Like, I'm sorry. Like, them shoe strangers, like, everything about this shoe, like, it is. And then it got the, um, the Mega Crush bottoms. Like, come on now, like, and that's also the bottoms from the Echo uh, Storms. And I kind of knew when we had got the Echo Storms, I kind of knew as well, like, it was coming. Like, it was inevitable that Crocs was finna get ready to spin the block. Also, with, with uh, Salehi releasing Polex sneakers, it just finna turn into a whole different vibe. And if you that fashion head, man... You really loving right now uh, what's going on with these things right now because they really, a lot of people don't wear clothes. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people don't wear sandals. People still uh, like to wear tennis shoes. This is it right here. Like, you know what I'm saying? Foam shoes, super duper live. I'm sure they're comfortable. You know what I'm saying? Just that that material on the inside and that material on the inside is kind of giving echo vibes. You know what I'm saying? I know it, uh, on the close up you can see that it's like netted, but underneath that net, I'm kind of feeling like light ride, uh, echo type feel. So man, I'm just hoping that this size 11 is what I need. You know what I'm saying? If not what I need, hopefully they don't hurt my feet because if they don't hurt my feet, I'm gonna keep these and I'll just get a 12 when they actually release them. Uh, in the stores, but man, I ain't gonna cap with y'all. I'm ready to get these boys on the foot. I've been ready before I even start doing all that talking with y'all about these boys, man. Let's go ahead and get these boys on the foot and we'll do a lot more chatting up. <laughs> Croc fam! Croc family! When I tell you, man, these boys is so drippy on the feet. I'm talking about, man, when you got them things on the feet, man, they is so drippy. And the comfort, the comfort, man. I'm talking about the comfort on these is like a, a sock type light rod vibe. And I'm loving it for me on that comfort straight 15 out of 10, your boy is sealed and locked in, you dig? These boys right here is 
fire. It is going down like chocolate time. You hear me? You know what I'm saying? These boys is playing. Let me flip the pants up for y'all one time. Flip them boys. Look that tongue on them. Flip that tongue up on them boys one time. Let y'all see what's real with them things you did. Yes, sir. <laughs> Look at the aesthetics. They kept it on these boys right too. Look at the back. Look at the back. <laughs> All right, let's talk sizing real quick. Because a lot of people ain't got these yet. Like I say, they ain't touched down like time by. So if you do got these right here, right now, hey, we one of them ones. If you got these right now, we one of them ones right now until these things touch ground. You hear me? Man. Okay, remember I told y'all I was desperate to get these. I really wanted to go with a size 12. I was just like, man, they tennis shoes. Know what I'm saying? I ain't hearing nothing about size down, so I'm going to go true. That's what I was telling myself. For the ones that don't know, for the ones that's just not getting with us, everybody already know I came from 11 and a half in sneakers. You know what I'm saying? 11 and a half, 12. So when I joined the Croc gang, I wore a size 12 into now. I would downsize occasionally for Polex and for Echoes. But for the most part, we 12s, you know what I'm saying? So 12 was going to be the move. 12 was going to be the vibe. But they don't got size 12s or 13s or 10s yet. I think they were just dancing around the other sizes to the other size or whatever. Seen 11 available, and I was just like, it's the closest thing to 12. You know what I'm saying? So I was like, man, hey, let's get them. Do I regret getting them, sizing down? I don't. Know what I'm saying? They do not hurt the feet. Know what I'm saying? I did run around the house a little bit before recording this part right here just to make sure they got that fit. And for me, I like how the 11 fit. Know what I'm saying? I like how the 11 fit. And like I say, I'm only speaking to the ones that got that half size narrow foot. You know, when you got that narrow foot, sometimes you can play in between sizes. Because I used to do it with my tennis shoes. Like, sometimes I could pull off of 11, depending on how the sneaker ran or what have you. You know what I'm saying? So, for me right now, I would say I can play these 11s. Now, I am going to give me a size 12 just to see if it's a slight difference. You know what I'm saying? I do notice they got, like, that slide-up part in the back. So, I'm thinking right now... The 11 might be the move. Because we all know, like, with these tennis shoes, with the tennis shoe type bobs, you can't really size up all the time just because based on how that back part play. You know what I'm saying? And remember, we talked about that with the uh, Polex clogs, how everybody was fitting on the front part where your toes at, but then it wasn't locking in on that heel, and you'll get that flop. So right now, I kind of feel like they not flopping. They right where they need to be. You know what I'm saying? They got a little, a minor slide, but they not flopping. So I do want to get the 12s just to see, like, if the 12s is going to be different as far as that flop. But as far as the um, the front part, I'm pretty cool right now. I've been in them, I say, you know what I'm saying? Plus this video right here, I've been in them 10 minutes plus however long we've been doing this right here. So, pretty good so far. Like I said, they got that light rod padding on the inside. And I do also love how they come off easy. You know what I'm saying? They come off, slide on pretty easy. And me, I kind of like that uh, that format that 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 I call it the standard, the default, whatever y'all want to call it. That tie that shoe companies be doing before they send the shoes out. How they just give you that generic tie. The last couple of pair of shoes that I got. I kind of left that tie right there. So me, I kind of like loosen my shoestrings up a bit, flap it out like that, like Tom about, and then I just let that play. So I think I'm kind of going to do these with these, and I like how that tongue is bulky and it's comfortable. It's like that, it's like that, Um, which pair was that? 
Damn, what, what Nikes was that? Y'all know the Nikes that I'm talking about? They wasn't the Air Force Ones, but the other Nikes that they had that had the little hanging strap. They used to have a flappy tongue. So it kind of got that flappy tongue type vibe to where you could really tuck some jeans or whatever. And man, that's that's fire. Look, see, that's fire right there. And that's that's just on if you're on that swag type of time and then the the uh generic tie on up, man. I'm just rocking with it. Man, for me, man, I ain't gonna even lie to y'all. I'm like so like between these, the Polex sneakers that's coming, the uh Echo Storms. I wore the Echo Storms, I think a few days after my birthday. I'm loving them too on the comfort, how they feel, sizing and all that. Between all of these, man. Crocs is headed into the right direction as far as just stepping into that different lane and bringing other people into our world. Because, you know, a lot of people, like I say, they don't wear clogs, they don't wear slides, whatever. A lot of people like to step out in sneakers. So I think that's what Crocs trying to do, like trying to reel those people in. And then you got other companies that's doing foam as well and people wearing them. So Crocs like, man, we want to kill that market too and get those people as well. And I think that they in the right ballpark of making it happen. Know what I'm saying? Because we all know Crocs is known for their comfort. But I would say for a first time on a runner sneaker slash what have you, whatever you want to call it, man, they killed it. And y'all already know I'm a details guy. Know what I'm saying? I talk details. Anybody know me, man? Back in school, coming up, whatever, I was always best, best dressed. Know what I'm saying? I always, and if I wasn't best dressed, I could acknowledge who was best dressed. I knew who was putting it on, who, who was coming with it. You know what I'm saying? I always had that eye for that fashion. You know what I'm saying? So I could tell you for me, just on a one-on-one, -on -one, just right out the bat for the first time, they killed it. Just aesthetically, like I say, this right here is like a netted sock. You know what I'm saying? That's netted sock vibes. Got the air holes in the front. And for you gibbet lovers, you can play around with them holes. I think you can might maybe smush something in there for you gibbet lovers. As a matter of fact, for you jibby lovers, let's go ahead and let me pull a jibbit off of one of these uh, pairs that I got up in here. Pull a jibbit off real, real quick, real, real quick. Jibbit, 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 jibbit. Any jibbit will do. We just trying to experiment. Any jibbit will work. Just for the jibbit lovers, let's see what we got. Hold on, let me take this off real quick. Just for the jibbit lovers, let's see what we got. And it's in the. Let me make sure it's all the way in there and I'm not just cap. Okay, it's in there. No cap. I don't see the back part no more. It's in there. So, like I say, for the gibbet lovers, you can add gibbets in them holes. You know what I'm saying? And that's secure. Like I say, it's that back part, you know it's secure when the back part flap underneath the shoe. So, that's secure right there. You got a few more holes. So, one, two, three. Four, five, six, six, seven holes, give or take each each shoe. But that's just some creativity if you want to play around just to show everybody like them Crocs. You know what I'm saying? Because I think just on initial look, most people are gonna be thinking like they are Adidas phones or anything like that because a lot of people not expecting Crocs to go this far. Like man, it's crazy. My homeboy uh, at work, he having he he didn't know the whole time that the uh, shoes that I was wearing was Crocs. You know what I'm saying? I was like, yeah, bro, these Crocs work sneakers or whatever. So just, it's just crazy, like, how they diving into a different lane where people is just not knowing. And if you want them to know, this will be a way to put it in their face right there. When they see gibbets, they'll know it's associated uh, with Crocs, clogs in some type of way. But, man, you can add on gibbets right there. I know the women, y'all going to put the little bedazzles, the little diamonds and stuff like that. Y'all going to make it y'all own. Man, these boys right here is super duper hard. Overall rating on these, 25 out of 10. I don't know if that's our highest rating so far, but man, these boys right here is spin feet. Let's do one more roller round on these boys. Anything that we didn't cover, I think we talked about everything. We talked about the fact that they haven't been released yet, but a few international sites been playing with them. If another one come back with one, I'll keep y'all. Y'all got to stay Stay tuned with the Insta uh, stories. You know what I'm saying? I call them Insta stories on YouTube because they little shorts. You know what I'm saying? Under a mini video. Stay tuned with them because I'm always dropping gems. I always letting y'all know what the releases is, what's going on, how it's going on, when it's going on. 
type stuff. You know what I'm saying? Stay ahead of that. We talked ratings. 25 out of 10 for the whiskey. We talked about coloring. These is the elephant ones. We talked about details, the shoestrings down to the tongue, down to the flap. I mean, you got your hole on them. You can put a little string through there and hang them up on something if you want to. We talked the knitted sock that's inside, that's securing it. You know what I'm saying? The mega crush, echo storm slash bottom. We talked about it all, man. <laughs> I mean, like, Nova Tricks, you know what I'm saying? Y'all been waiting to see these. I've been waiting to see these. Here it go. Who all rock? Who all got down with your boy, man? Who all rocked on me? Who all rocked on me, man? Talk to me. What we doing? Once again, Croc fam, I want to know, like, who all came through with them good old Nova Trek joints, man? Crocs is really diving into a different lane right now. We talking shoes right now. Tennis shoe. We talking runner work right now with the foam in there, man. Look, I dropped the short on these. If you didn't see the short, go check the short out. I did say which site they on. I'm not sure if the site still got some in stock. You know these boys is a hot commodity right now. They're the hottest thing smoking. You know what I'm saying? There ain't even a release yet. So, man, if you was lucky to get these boys, I know you loving them like I'm loving them. You know what I'm saying? You loving everything about these joints. They're beautiful, aesthetically Comfortable, man. Come on. Stop playing. Talk to your boy. Let me know what we doing. Them good old Nova tricks. Jill.